everyone, I'm Robert. I'm Fastest from Gunsmoke. Where are you, Miss Kitty? <laughs> I'm mighty fine, Festus. <laughs> That's for you, Elf Lord. <laughs> Anyway, this is a day before a stormy day. <laughs> okay, so we have a kind of another winter storm coming in, and it's supposed to be super windy, we're supposed to have snow and all that fun stuff, and depending on what weather app I look at, we range from low of 6 degrees to minus 2. Yeah. So we have to get ready for that, we have to put away <laughs> all of our stuff, get some wood in here and all that fun stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is, the, uh, this is the winter we've been waiting for. Uh, they say the winter's out here pretty darn cold, so uh, we've been, you know, sort of waiting, preparing, slash whatever for this, but with that comes serious winds, and you know our struggle with winds out here. It's time to go around the property, make sure everything's buttoned down, put away, because uh, uh, we're expecting snow. Does it say how much snow we're supposed to get? It doesn't. I can't find any, like... <clears throat> precipitation wise and then the the wind's supposed to be pretty high you know <clears throat> when gusts around 50 to 60. no miles. i didn't see 60. i saw 59. you did i saw a gust of 59. so on the report so that's anticipated so uh we'll just go around the property today clean stuff up but uh <clears throat> they say that uh right around halloween is when you get the first snows and uh then you know after that it's pretty much downhill for the season so. Yeah, and looking at the next week and going forward, beginning, you know, Monday, um, lows overnight are now going to always be down in the teens mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, low 20s. So time to light off the wood stove for good, yeah. uh, probably continuously for the next several months. Good thing we have several cords of wood. Well, I don't know. I wonder about how much we'll need it in the daytime because it stays pretty warm in here. And the highs are going to be like 60 but lows of 20 <laughs> or 15. Yeah, but as the season goes on, you'll get highs of 30 right, or 20 but, or 10. Yeah, you know, like so. next the next few weeks. <clears throat> it doesn't get super cold during the daytime yet. Yet, but it will. Uh, they say it's not unusual to get 20 below uh, for, you know, a week or two weeks on end. So, fun, fun, fun. <laughs> Let's get to it. All right. <laughs> Thanks for watching. You ready for winter storms, Reba? Huh? You ready for winter storms? How about you, Roscoe? You ready? Huh? You guys ready for the cold? Let's go check out your house. Well, here's the dog's house. <laughs> Robert and I put <clears throat> two layers of this plastic, you know, here to sort of help keep out the winds and things. They, I don't think they like these sheets and blankets we put in here. But uh, <clears throat> there is... There is hay in there. I think we need to... You know, top off this hay, clean it out, replenish it, something. <laughs> All right, there it is. Now I have to haul in a billion pounds of wood. Let's go get it. This scene reminds me of a guy I saw in uh, Key Largo back in the 90s, early 2000s, something like that. Uh, his bakery made key lime pie, and he would stand out on the on the front porch of his bakery every morning showing styling with a pie He'd go like this. Uh, you look good. I made that and I wasn't able to bake it and it got oozy and gross. It's probably not going to be that great now. Be fine. But it's peach. It's each hip's favorite. Yeah, we need to get this thing baked. <laughs> Let's do this. 
They can bake while we do other things. It's only 150 in here, but that's okay. We'll let it warm up. Thank you for making that, babe. Well, let's make sure the batteries are watered up. Curses. Clouds. So much for being able to bake a pie in the sun oven today. We'll do something different. The pie pan is too big to go in the Dutch oven here, or we could, you know, bake it that way. So, we have a large skillet that I... I don't know if you can see it. There's one of them. I put three stainless steel spoons in the bottom to elevate that Pyrex dish above the bottom of the pan so it would, wouldn't break and so you get even, good heating all the way around. And I just put it on the stove. <laughs> and uh, so far it seems to be doing okay. The crust is browning, as you can see. That's just started to happen. And uh, it looks like the center of the pie is raising up. So we might have success here. I'm just going to have to monitor it because I can't, I don't know the temperature and it's hard to control. And there it is. Baked pie in the skillet. <laughs> Let it cool and see how it, see how it tastes. the next day and we've had a pretty good winter storm um, it's still pretty cold out there it's morning and uh, so we're enjoying some hot chocolate and warmth from the wood stove if you hear background noise there that's the dogs munching on some rawhide or something it's 11 degrees outside and 70 something in here I can't see it because it's not as big almost 80 <clears throat> but, uh, yeah wood stove seems to be working fine um, of course, we're burning spruce, so it burns fast. So today's a uh, kickback day. We're going to make some earth ship pozole. We've got a video on that. We'll point you to it. Um, and, uh, you know, who knows? Maybe work a puzzle or work on some videos uh, to upload so you can see them. And uh, so that's our day today. Just snowy. I'm going to go take... Cold. Sorry. I'm going to go outside and take some pictures. And send them to my family. Visibility isn't that great because it's still cloudy and snowing and things like that. But uh, when it clears up, we we'll probably have some great pictures of mountains and things like that. I know that this uh, storm is blowing through the center of the country right now. I hope uh, any of you who are in the path of this thing are doing well. We're doing just fine. We are cozy in our little shouse. We are warm. And uh, it's a happy day for me. <laughs> I'm sleepy. Usually on days like this, of course, I was a teacher, would have resulted in a snow day for us. And so I usually made tasty treats, things like cookies or some, mostly cookies because I like cookies a lot. But I can't make cookies here because I don't have an oven. So we do have pie. Yeah. So I hope your day is good. We're doing great here. And there is a meal for a cold day. Earth Ship Pasoli. See, check out one of our prior videos on this. Earth Ship Pasoli. We'll leave the link or you can get the card above or click on it or something like that. But uh, this is excellent stuff. Mm -hmm. 